setup and operation of all new focus lasers are extremely simple. The first step in turning on your Vortex Plus is to ensure that you have the proper fuses in place in the 6700LN controller according to your electrical outlet requirements. Refer to the manual for more information and watch the Velocity 6700 YouTube video for a demonstration on changing fuses. Then, plug in the power cord, the laser cable to the laser head and back of the controller and power on. To turn the laser on, power on the back switch after hooking up the power and the laser head. The first thing you'll notice is that the controller will recognize that this is a vortex laser. It will display the center wavelength that the laser is set at at the factory. To turn the laser power on, simply turn the key to on and press the power button. You can adjust the current either with the knob or with the arrows. But most importantly, you cannot exceed the maximum current set for this particular laser head. As I have already mentioned, the 6700 controller is compatible with both the new Velocity Laser and Vortex Plus. So not all of the functions of the 6700LN controller are activated when the Vortex Plus is connected. The functions are power on and off, current, piezo percent, which tunes the laser wavelength across the fine tuning range. In the submenu, you can find laser head status information. Simply press the enter button to go into the submenus. The BNC connections on the back panel for Vortex Plus operation are trigger input, auxiliary in, current modulation input, and frequency modulation input. The wavelength input and wavelength output BNCs are for velocity DC motor wide tuning operation and not applicable to the Vortex Plus precision tunable laser. While you can adjust the piezo voltage, thus wavelength tune, from the front panel, you also have the option to apply DC current to the frequency modulation input of up to plus or minus three volts to cross the entire fine tuning range. You can also apply a waveform signal using a function generator to accomplish piezo wavelength sweeping for a bandwidth up to two kilohertz. We recommend a triangle or sawtooth waveform. Similarly, you can use the current modulation input for diode current control with modulation bandwidth up to 1 megahertz. High speed current modulation up to 100 megahertz is accomplished through the SMA port on the laser head. This provides current directly to the diode. Just be careful not to exceed one volt peak to peak to protect the diode from damage. And there you go, very simple. Give us a call and ask for someone in the awesome new focus tech team to get more information.